Okay, I'm done with this coloring on the ground. So I will do blending again. So again, click this one, the blending tools, and then the opacity should be zero and the blending should be 100%. Then you can decide how big is your smudge will be. Big and then small. This is quite small place, so you need to just put seven maybe if it's on this work and then start blending again, do smudging. Uh, imagine this is your finger smudging around the colors. But right now we are using, again, maybe mouse, maybe a mouse pad or stylus or your finger in the iPad. Yeah, carefully blend them. Be patient because it takes time. You can also zoom in and zoom out. Let's say I will do zoom in, I mean zoom out, so I will do click this plus sign. But if you want to move them, just click this hand, yep, and then click it, so it will go uh, bring your works and pictures around it. Okay, let's see just here, and then click the brush again. And then start do the blending again. Remember, you have to uh, blend the colors between them, not like, you know, like across like that, but again, between the colors, because the result will be different if you if you like across it like that. It will just blend everywhere. Be careful of the part that is not supposed to be blending. Check again which part that you need to blend. Yeah, sometimes they you miss them. Sometimes maybe they're not really blending really well. So, so you can always go back to the part that you want to blend it. Okay, let's see if we zoom in this one. Let's see how it works. Oh, one more time. Okay, this one zoom in. Well, it's quite good because all the colors are blending. Yep. Yeah? And we can see the difference between the mountain and then this is the bushes. Yeah, and the ground too. Now, next step is the water. 